Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about integration. So now I will show you how to answer. We can do about factorization by s. Next, we can use about partial fractions. So I will put about 8 over s and later that we see that this is about s square that means on numerator there should be about b s so they should reduce one unit of the power in here and then we have c s square plus 10 next we need to do about common denominator So, capital A multiplied by S square plus 10 and, and S multiplied by B S plus C. So, this one in here, we have same. Now, we need to expand. We will have about A S square plus 10 A s multiplied by b s and c b s square plus c s next we need to arrange based on the term of s about s square we have a plus b about s we have c about nothing we have 10 a Now, we need to arrange based on the coefficient of s. We don't have s where that means a plus b equal to number 0, c equal to number 2, 10 a equals to negative number 3. And now, we create the system of equations. So we have 8 equals to negative number 3 over 10, b equals to 3 over 10, c equals to number 2. So we put a, b, c go in here. a, that's about negative number 3 over 10, b, that's about 3 over 10. C, that's about number 2. Now, we need to separate this one in here. We will have about 3 over 10 multiplied by S over S square plus 10. And this one, we have number 2 over S square plus 10. And now, the integral of this one in here we will have about negative number 3 over 10 ln of the absolute value of s the integration of this one in here we will have about 1 over 2 ln of the absolute value of s square plus 10 number 2 with number 10 we have 3 over 20 the integration of this one in here we will have about 2 over the square root of number 10 or time of s over the square root of number 10 and we put about c this is the end thank you for watching